Hello guys, today, I Shivam Tyagi and my friend Satyam Tyagi are going to explain you a project on smart traffic light control system. But before moving on to the smart system, let's first see the disadvantages of the current system. Right now, vehicles will cross the zebra crossing line while standing in the traffic light. This will automatically increase the traffic outside the barricades. And simultaneously pedestrians crossing the zebra crossing line also faces a lot of problems due to these types of activities. To overcome this problem, we have placed the automatic barricades before the zebra crossing. So that no vehicles can cross the line. Meanwhile, the traffic system is also regulated without any problem. So here, in this circuit we are using Arduino Uno R3 as a board for PIC microcontroller. And now here we are using transformer as a power circuit or power supply which is used to give power ups to the PIC microcontroller and subsystems. And here, for programming of street lights, we are using LDR sensors that's light dependent resistors. It's used for controlling automatic street lights. So, when the light will fall on the LDR, the voltage will vary accordingly. Thus, when sunlight is present, the street lights will be off, and when there is no light or during night time, the street light will on automatically. And now we are using LEDs as traffic light in traffic junction, having four lanes. Now we have four directions, and in that four directions, we need to control the traffic light. Means, if the traffic light in one direction is green, then in other direction it is red. Now, the major thing we are using in this project is automatic barricades. So, for automatic barricades, we are using 4SG90 servo motors that are used for automatic controlling of barricades. And now we have to place these four servo motors on the four lanes of traffic junction. And now what we have to do is we have to join all the four servo motors and traffic junction and all the programs with PIC microcontroller so that servo motors and traffic lights will be connected to each other. Now when there is red light in one direction, the barricades will automatically come down and will close the path of vehicles and in the another direction where the traffic light is green, the barricades will automatically move in upward direction, hence opening the path of the vehicle. So, here, we can see, that, when there's green light, the barricades or servo motors, moves in upward direction, whereas, when there's red light they move in, downward direction. So, here we can see, that, when there's no light, the street lights will automatically turn on. And, if the light is present, the street lights will automatically turn off.